This is a simple video that I put together to show you how to use the Stack Navigator in React Native to show how clicking or your click event can um, push a new screen onto the stack. As you see here in the code right now, I have my basic home screen. I'm now adding a detail screen to this project. Oh, and by the way, this is all done with the, um, the Snack uh, Online IDE. Um, so I basically duplicated my original screen and I've created my detail screen. So now I have two screens. I'm going to show how to use a buttons click event to push the next screen onto the stack. And as you can see here, I'm creating the on press event. And in the on press event, we will have the call using the navigator that gets passed along to all screens that are part of the stack. So you can see I have this props, this property that has the navigation navigator on it, and that's what I will use. Um, we're going to use the name of the screen that I created. As you can see, I have the detail screen here. That's what we're going to use to push the new screen onto the stack. Okay. We need to make sure that we have access to the properties that get pushed in since the Navigation object is on the properties, so we've added the constructor to both of our screens to give us that ability. Okay, now it looks like we're in a better situation here. Um, we are going to save our stack and run it again. Oops, there seems to be another problem. There's a slight spelling error on the actual method. We switch it to navigate. Looks like things are running. And here we go, we're going back and forth between our screens. This is pretty good. Thank you very much for watching the video, and stay tuned. Future is written in code.